Hello, second graders. How are you? It's Mrs. Noward here, and I thought we would review a little OG blending board before we went over our spelling pattern this week. So here we go. Please say the words with me, and let's count to see how many real words we come up with. Oops, starting off strong. Here we go. Who? Um. Lum. There's one. Boo. Um. Blum. Boo. Ush. Blush. Boo. Ursh. Blursh. Kersh. Kersh. Burr, ursh, bursh. Let's change out this er. Burr, ish, brish. Burr, ig, brig. W, ig, wig. We're already up to three. T, ig, tig. Tick, there's four. T, auk, tauk. Would we have this O, W with the C, K at the end? No, we wouldn't because this does not follow the one, one, one rule that you would need the C, K. This needs to be a wimpy vowel. <clears throat> T, auk, talk, that's five. <clears throat> v, auk. Vok. V odd. Vod. Sm odd. Smod. F odd. Fod. F aid. Fade. Oh, sounds like a real word. However, fade is F A D with the magic E at the end. A. Faith. Again, we wouldn't have this FF because of the 1-1-1 one, one, one rule. This would have to be a short, wimpy vowel. F. Fef. P. F. Pef. Spur. F. Spreff. K. F. Alf, calf, kaus, kaus, kass, kass, kat, cat. There's six. Squat, squat. It's actually a word called squat, if because that it, it would change to squat. Let's see. L at lat lert lert d ert dirt sounds like a real word however it wouldn't be u r it would be i r you got it d erks dirks d orks dorks Sounds like you're calling people a name, a bunch of dorks. However, that would be a K-S at the end. And not a very nice thing to say. The orch, dorch. The urch, dirch. Dirch, <laughs> dirch. Let's change this one. Urch, perch. Ursh, hirsh. Ursh, search. Sir, nk, sir, nk. That I R N K is tricky. Sark, <laughs> sark. Let's see if we can find the short vowel left. Well, let's change our ending. Sarn, sarn. Quarn. 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 Clarn. 
Clark. Clark, there's a name. I think we're up to seven now. Stark. Stark. Spark. Splark. Spleek. Spleek. Skeek. Skeek. Skeeth. Skeeth. Skr eeth, screeth, gr eeth, greeth, gr eeth, greeth. Let's change our ending here. Gr eeth, greeth, g eeth, geep, g each, geech, n each, niche. Our last vowel sound. A. Nay. There's a word. There's number eight. A. There's another word. Full A. Not a word. Per A. Phrase a word. I believe we came up with nine words today, boys and girls. That's pretty impressive. I don't think we've ever had that many in my classroom. However, I gave you more sounds today than we normally do in one lesson. All right, so we are today learning about O-O. So far, boys and girls, we learned O-O says ow, like in the word, um, or not ow, I'm sorry. We learned O-O says ooh, like look, book. But we're also gonna talk about how O-U also says uh, and ooh. So this week we're doing uh, like the word foot. And foot can be then turned into a compound word. You can have foot ball. You could have barefoot, which is a spelling word for some of you. You can also have the word book or bookshelf. You can have the word look, look out, or overlook something. You can have the word zoo. A zoo, say uh, no, we would put zoo down here. That's o o o compared to the o o u, like Captain Hook, right? Another word let's think about is room. Would we put room up here or would that be a word we would put in our thinking box? Oom. Does it say uh or oo? It says oo. So room would go down here. The same with the word broom would be o o oo. What about the word pool? Pool. Oh is o o o but we have wood and woodpecker as o o u all right boys and girls good luck with your spelling words this week i hope this helped you and i hope you have a fun week at home hope to see you soon bye